This is episode 96. It is May 8th. And I'm tired. I need a nap. Ugh, I need a nap last night. And then I napped a little bit this morning. But I need a nap. Today, we have a quickie. You ready for a quickie? Are you in the mood for a quickie? Um, I had this idea yesterday. And I was like, well, let me put it off because I actually want to do something without Trump. Since I was thinking about the... I thought, man, it'd be really cool to do two cartoons in a row without Trump. Because I did the Blankenship thing. And yesterday I did something on Jeff Sessions. And that's Trump related, but Trump is not in the cartoon. But I had this idea, and I thought I better draw it now. Because Rudy Giuliani may not last that long. I thought, man, he might be gone before the cartoon's even drawn. But he's still, he's still in there. He's still spouting. So, um... I just want to whip this out, hint, Ariel, and do it really, really quick. And uh, could have drawn it quicker. It took me an hour and 21 minutes. Our video today is a little bit over eight, which is pretty short for us. I'm going to say us because you guys are a part of this now. Uh, I probably spent half of this thing trying to draw Rudy. Last week, I drew a caricature of the guy. And I didn't even try. I just like pfft, on the paper, on the page, on the screen. I don't use paper anymore. Um, and everybody was like, "Whoa, dude, that's like the best Giuliani I've ever seen, bro." Sorry, I just saw Donatello's excellent adventure the other night. Um, I was like, "Thank you." I was like, "I think, I think, I think about it." It's like, "Woo, yeah, yeah. And I saw it all on all sorts of platforms. People were just all, "Hey, that Rudy's great." And today I couldn't capture it. And I, I didn't look at any photos of the guy. I didn't look at any other cartoons. I just looked at the cartoon I did last time. But I didn't really just want to uh, copy it. I wanted to give it some flair. But, you know, what wasn't really doing it for me was the body language. Just the standing there. I mean, Trump just standing there is fine because he's got the big belly and everything. But really had to do a little bit more. So, I thought he should be leaning forward a bit. And he looks like that vampire from the first black and white vampire movie ever made. Black and white might be redundant, of course. It was black and white. Black and white first first black and white vampire movie. Yeah, that's redundant. But you know what the bald vampire and he's got the Rudy Giuliani mouth. Except the teeth aren't as brown and yellow. Um but he's got those long creepy fingers. That's still kinda scary. Like made in the thirties, still kinda scary. Um, so yeah, how many times did I draw Giuliani for this? I should go back and count. I don't know, people. I just do not know how many times did I do it. Man, my, um, voiceovers bar is not showing up. I don't know why. As long as it works, though. As long as it works. There's all sorts of other things I can do with this program. I... There's actually music I can steal, legally, and put it in here. But I haven't even looked into how to, to do that. Hmm. Hey, there's sound effects, too. I might play with that someday. Over the weekends and junk. Yeah. Last weekend's uh, project was vacuuming in the bedroom. And I did it. I planned five days to vacuum. It took like five minutes, but it took me like a week to plan it out. I do like this Rudy. I don't like it as much as my other Rudy, but I do like this one. I like the body language. And then I redid the tie and the tongue. Because I just had to do it right. And now that I look at it, I kind of wish that I had moved the tie just a little bit more. Put a little bit more to it in this one spot. But it's fine. It's fine. I wanted to see... Um, how this cartoon would do. Uh, I didn't really want to write a whole bunch about it because I already wrote about Rudy G and his uh, shenanigans and his stupidity. So I didn't really want to write a long blog for it and I thought, okay, I'll put it on the website, but let me share the image on Facebook and just see how that does. Because images always get more uh, shares and comments and likes and views and um, then links. And so far, let me go over here and look. It has 12,000 likes. No, I just made that number up. It has uh, about 50 likeies and, and reactions and 61 shares. And it's been up for four hours. 
It could be doing a lot better, but it's not. But that's not bad. And it has attracted uh, a troll who just did this big long rant uh, on the thread, posting a bunch of memes, calling people libtards and fucktards. Sorry to curse, but I'm quoting somebody here, okay? And I got everybody excited, all my liberal friends excited, just had to go fight with the guy. And there wasn't even a debate. There was just a bunch of cursing at each other. <laughs> so, Russian troll farms, people. They come out. I really like the tongue in here. I like the way the tongue worked out. In the tie. It was fun. Anyway, I wanted to do this video. The only person I'm going to give a shout out to right now is Ariel. Because nobody has commented on episode 95 yet. But she commented on 94 right after I had made that video. And I thought, man, she got robbed of her shout out. So, Ariel, you're getting your shout out right now. Hope you like it. I got it at Target. No, I'm <laughs> kidding. It's 8 o'clock. It's time to find out if the crazy, convicted, racist dude is going to win in West Virginia. I also want to find out about this oligarch who's uh, giving money to Michael Cohen. What for? Where would that money go? And I probably got to do something tonight on the Iran nuclear deal. Did you like the way I made Rudy's teeth kind of yellow? I used a different paint for this one also, for the whole thing, just about, except for the background. I gave it a light grayish background, but I don't know if that's showing up. And that's okay. I didn't want a lot in there. Wow, it's showing up very, very little, which is okay. That's all right. It's all good. Um, yeah, I just used this broad, this bold pink thingy. I thought it was good for the spontaneity and the style, whatever. I want to use that a little bit, go back and forth between that and my Filbert brush. Change things up. I'm going to make my backgrounds a little bit grayer too, instead of like different colors. Just It's like if I'm going to stick with one color for a while for it. And this was what a friend was talking to me about. Uh, Ashley Karen, you know her. She told me that I should like do the light gray for a lot of stuff. So I decided... I've done that before, but I'm going to do it more and more, a little bit, for now. I always change my minds and change some things up. I really like the color of the tongue, too. I really like this tongue. I sound like a freak, aren't I? I like the tongue. It is so interesting. Tongue. Not on the first date. There's your cartoon. We are done. I... I'm glad I made this video, get it out of my life. I'm going to go draw another cartoon later, drink some coffee, and uh, I want to thank you for coming by, enjoying this short video, or hating it. Give me a thumbs up if you like it. Give me a thumbs down if you think it sucked balls. Um, and uh, click, I said click like, uh, share, and comment, leave me a comment, and subscribe to my channel. Goodbye, see you later. Bye. Bye.